It was so early, but we wanted to get the minus 1.7 low tide. back out and you're feeling your way with the wire to find where the biggest hole is and that's where the fish is hanging out. Go nice and slow. Easy, easy. Give it a minute. If there's anybody under there, they're going to say, oh, that smells like muscle. Oh. And I really like muscle. Get another bite. Yeah. There you go. Pull it. Pull it out. There you go. There you go. Booyah. So we get, get in there, the Monica, too. Oh, no. Oh, wait. We get yeah. the fish we get first. Thank you, buddy. You're going to be our lunch. Booyah. Booyah. Want a keyhole limpet to try? Yeah. You want to try one? and you'll see why it's a cute little limpet. That was kind of fun getting it. Yep. Now we can't harvest abalone, yeah. um, but we can harvest keyhole limpets. These look awfully like abalone. He's hooked. How does it feel? I think she's just biting. If he was hooked, she'd drop more. Not always. I've had huge ling pod and cabazon go bink, just like that. And you don't think there's anything on there until you pull them out and you've got a big fish. Do you see that? Yeah. See how it telegraphs into this? Into this? These are super sensitive. It's like when you're using the, all the newer lines and stuff. Yeah. How when you're 200 feet down, you can feel the bite. You can feel that there's sand or rock on the bottom. It's the same with these silly old PVC poles. Oh, there we go. He's playing with it. Okay. Take the wire. He's biting again. Okay. He might be stealing all your bait, though, Booger. You take them off the hook. Oh, okay. Uh, Hold on. Ooh, that's a you want to do it? I'm um, sure. I'm not a big hook taker. Sure. There you go. I should be Mimi and not good at uh, unhooking. Uh, Have you done that before? Uh, there you go. Perfect. Perfect. Yes! Uh, Monica told me to put it right in there and I was feeling little taps, but it didn't feel like his hook. Mm -hmm. I kept bringing it out and then it kept putting it back in. And then I finally pulled it out, and it finally went bam, 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 and I bring it out, got this big eel. Oh yeah. Is that the biggest one you've caught? Probably. <laughs> I've seen bigger, but I've never caught this big. That's oh. not bad. It's your personal best. Not personal bad. best deal. Now, when I was little, um, my, I'd be in school, and my mom would go with her girlfriend, yeah. pick us up at school when I was in elementary school, and take us out fishing right after school. And just like you and your mom and your dad, so it's just like watching me when I was little. Same thing. Too. So yeah. it just makes my heart feel good to see a young person like you and mom. And where's dad? Dad. Hi, dad. 
He's over there catching fish too. He's, really he's small. jealous of me. He's jealous of me. <laughs> I have to wait until he sees this one. <laughs> like, dang. <laughs> All right, let's go see if we can catch him. So much Whoa. Oh, I remember Taco talked about this in his videos. There you go. Get you want to hold it? There. See how he's curling up? They're actually moving. Look. Yep. He's going to eat me. He's, he's related to, I think, abalone and um, limpets and things. Is he Pac-Man? He does look like Pac-Man, doesn't he? Okay, put him the other way around. Face down. There you go. Alright. He's going to make himself curl. Yeah, he'll uncurl. Take it. Let him take it. That could be a good grassy, a cabazon, or an eel. Let him chew on it. I'm not feeling it anymore. If I'm good. Nope, nope. Gently pull and see. I saw that pull. Okay. Where are you, is where he is still pull? Huh? I can't see where she's That's just under a rock. Well, is he still pulling? Yeah. Is he you think he's got it good? Uh, I'm not sure. Give a little tug and see if he pulls back. Oh, yeah. it's pulling. It's pulling. Okay, remember how when you pull it up you have to hold it how you held it for the eel? I want you to do the same thing. <laughs> it's a black and yellow rock. Yeah. But you can see he's black and yellow. Yeah. Cool. Okay. Oh god, he's got the whole thing in his mouth. There we go. Later. Watch out, Erica. Great that you're doing a Patrick hook one here. Yep. I know. 
that's what we wanted to do the whole yeah, time. When, 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 when we heard you were coming, and we said, we got to do a catch and cook. <laughs> and I didn't know you liked urchin, uni, until that's the Leroy, other day. That's Leroy's favorite. This is my favorite. I can eat uni all day long. Me too. When I was a kid, I used to dive in Japan and jump off the thing, get the uni, and my mom would put them on a thing of a bowl of rice. And we ate it like that, just on rice. And we called it unidon. Unidon. Yeah, donburi. Donburi means on top of rice. I prefer to have the every essence of the uni, uh -huh. so I just eat it alone. So there's no other taste disrupting it. Really? Yeah. No soy sauce, no wasabi. Nothing. I can make a, I'm gonna make sushi if you want to try it with sushi. Yeah, yeah, I'll definitely try it with sushi. But it's like when I usually eat it, I, l I have nothing else to eat it with because my mom doesn't do very good like you. Oh, yeah? Beautiful. I don't, I don't have a lot of... You don't need to make them look good. It's what matters. Is what okay, it. here we go. You want to take it over? Uh, uh, I'll do it. Yeah. Here. <laughs> Got some good pictures of that. Right here, okay? Soy sauce right here. I, I prefer not to have soy sauce. Okay. Here you go. And anybody wants wasabi? Here's some wasabi right here. You just throw that piece it out. Yeah, and okay. you says it doesn't get any fresher and it's not pricey. <laughs> get it now everybody. How wow. is it? Well, it's, so good. it's the ocean. <laughs> it's the ocean in your mouth. It's like the rich, the really rich part of an oyster. That's probably like the best way to describe it. But it's definitely all there if you really like that. Oh it's hard to describe. How do you describe it Rich? I describe it kind of creamy. Creamy, yeah. A creamy, um, a little nutty with the flavor of the ocean. That's the best way to put it. I would agree. And in a roll like that, nice and uh, portable. <laughs> Keyhole limpid, but it's like a it keyhole tastes like a keyhole limpid. <laughs> yeah. Like, do you think it's gonna be like a scallop almost? No, like, yeah, it's, yeah, it's kind of, yeah, it has the texture like... of a scallop, but tastes uh -huh. like calamari. Kind of. mm, nice, oh. so delicious. Bed truck of a Honda Ridge line. You can do it. It's done. A very special thanks to Monica, Leroy, and Edward for taking us to such a special place. This is me, Fish Fish. Peace out.